camera. News 12's Andrew Anger spoke to the chief who isn't denying the allegations but says his intent wasn't malicious. The South Country Ambulance Company is well respected here on Long Island and across New York State. But a Pellport motorist says Wednesday he saw an ambulance company SUV driving in an unsafe manner into Gazola Park here in Bellport. He says he went and confronted the driver about that, but little did he know that that would start a string of events that would end with a small car accident and, he says, being slapped by the ambulance company chief. Sure you got it all on camera? How did South Country Ambulance Chief Greg Lee Migliano Jr., that's him approaching the camera, get into this situation? According to Thomas Schultz, it started Wednesday evening here at Tony Gazzola Park in Bellport. Schultz says he saw a South Country Ambulance SUV driving erratically and in an unsafe manner as it approached the park. He says it was driven by Chief of Administration Amy Price Thomas. Schultz says he drove his car next to hers as they both were dropping off their kids in the park. I asked her why she thought she had the right to uh, drive so erratically. And um, she got very angry and upset with me, started shouting that I was harassing her and that I was following her. But Price Thomas sees the interaction differently. I was scared for myself, my son. I don't know what he was saying. All I kept telling him was, please get away from me. Price Thomas says she drove out of the lot but pulled over along the side of the road. And that's when Schultz says he got into a fender bender with a truck that was parked next to hers in the middle of the road. That's when Schultz started videotaping and he says the driver of the truck struck him. Then Schultz says he recognized ambulance chief Gregory Migliano arrive and approach him in an aggressive manner and struck him as well. Migliano says the slap was in self-defense as he was concerned about Price Thomas. I would definitely say emotions were uh, in play, but we're never going to tolerate anybody setting upon or membership like that. Suffolk police investigated and charged Schultz with criminal mischief for the accident. However, Schultz says officers didn't want to look at the video or hear about the slaps. I don't know what went wrong with regard to the police not willing to accept my side of the story as valid, especially when I had video proof that they refused to look at. News 12 has reached out to the Suffolk County Police to see if they've taken a look at that videotape. We're still waiting to hear back from them. In a side note, Miglino and Price Thomas are both running for the South Country School Board. And they both say that it seems really odd that this situation would come about before tomorrow's vote. Now, Schultz says this had nothing to do with the election tomorrow and that he was the one who was slapped. We'll stay on top of this story in Bellport, Andrew Anger News 12, Long Island.